Moving on to something a little bit more global now. Um, we went from the medical, translated a little bit into the fictitious. Now we're diving into something along, along the Polish business side. Uh, what is this fascination with Poland and why are people investing in Polish companies? Uh, well, so Sova Marketing, uh, this, uh, this marketing company, uh, came from QB. Uh, we found out, uh, my team and I, found out that we contract a lot of Polish companies to do things. For example, IT. IT is huge. And the IT companies here are as good, if not better. Third best in the world. Exactly. Then uh, some of the UK companies, then some of the US companies that we've worked with. Uh, we also found that the marketing uh, side of uh, Poland, uh, the graphics company, the animators, the film production companies are as good, if not better, than some of the UK and US companies that we've worked with to produce the marketing content that we need to promote QB. And through contracting and working with these Polish companies, we've decided, look, we don't need to just uh, do this just for QP. We can do this for other aspiring companies that would love a, uh, say, an affordable uh, price to IT services, to marketing services, at a fraction of the cost that they would have to pay in the UK or in the US. And of course, with good quality, um, you know, QP, uh, the, the quality of the marketing and the uh, IT of QP uh, is uh, uh, on par with what would have been produced in the US or in the UK. Using Polish companies, Polish resources. Correct. Mm, there is a common misconception that uh, Poland does not equate to fantastic quality. What do you, what do you think of that statement? Well, uh, I agree and I disagree. Here's why. Um, Poland, as well as Central Europe and Eastern Europe, has been held back uh, due to, say, uh, communism. <laughs> and uh, as now, as a capitalistic uh, society and uh, country, we are talking about uh, looking at Poland uh, 10 years ago and to now, uh, they have vastly grown. Uh, they, they're part of the EU. They, uh, they are building. There's cranes everywhere. They are expanding. Sure, we can see it from this rooftop. Exactly, and they are growing. So with that growth comes um, obviously uh, a lot of money. Uh, and with that money comes a lot of uh, good talent. You know, talent that, uh, uh, again, because of the Zloty, compared to, say, a pound or a U.S. dollar. Yeah, relatively affordable. Relatively affordable. You know? and, there's, and there's no shortage of talent here? Oh, no, it's always increasing. Uh, I've, been, I've been back and forth from the U.S. to Poland for the last three years, and uh, it's amazing. Every year, I just, uh, uh, it's easier and easier to find good talent. Well, in that case, we wish you the greatest. All right, thank you very much, Max. Jason, it's a pleasure to have you. Thank you. Join us on our next video as we'll interview Damien.